What is up, party people? It is F1 season, and we are here at the Amber Lounge party, traditionally attended by the who's who of the F1 party circuit. So let's go check out how the party action is this year. Touted as one of the best F1 parties in Singapore, the annual Amber Lounge party was attended by close to a thousand guests. This year's team was an adrenaline fueled mix of high speed and high fashion. Kickstarting the event was none other than Tayo Cruz, who performed Little Bad Girl, David Guetta's latest single, which Cruz featured alongside American rapper Ludacris. <laughs> The next lap of the night saw 8 F1 drivers off the track and onto the runway as they modeled designer suits from Canali. Razor TV caught up with them before the show to find out how they felt about walking a fashion show. Minutes away from the catwalk, how are you feeling right now? Well, you know, definitely, you know, excited experience because first time for me and, you know, completely different from our racing world. So, you know, quite interesting. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of an unknown, honestly, so I don't really know what to feel. But, um, you know, it's quite exciting and there's quite a few guys I know here. So, you know, we're, we're going to have a laugh and uh, have fun with it. You know, great clothes, great friends and uh, beautiful women. <laughs> you can't complain. Can't complain. It's, I'm more nervous about doing this than I am getting in a Formula 1 car. I think this is more nerve-wracking for me, yeah. Being 5'5", five five, uh, up against some of the girls that are 6'5", is quite intimidating. How, how does it feel to be walking in Canali? Uh, you know, it feels great. Yeah, definitely one of the nicest suits I've ever worn. But, uh, yeah, you know, I guess we'll wait and see. What are you most worried about going out there? The pose bit. When they say pose for two seconds, what do I do? Do you do then one of them? No, what, what, let, let's practice. Let's practice. If we say pose now, strike me your best pose. Oh, Come on, think, think GQ. One of them. Or you could do one of them. I want Robert to bend over because there's a really strong likelihood that the trousers will break. Really? Are they, are they a bit tight? They're a bit snug, yeah. But uh, you still, no, still comfortable in them? Yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's all right. I'm just, I'm just worried about bending over. But if they had the chance to choose between the road and the runway, what would they pick? If you had a choice, would you choose the runway or the highway? Uh, the highway. <laughs> so go with the highway? Highway. Highway. Driving. Absolutely. Easy. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah, def definitely driving. You know, I I'm so lost with this walking stuff, I don't know what to do. So. <laughs> Hitting the Amber Lounge event this year was a fashion show by renowned designer and couturier Frederick Lee. Razor TV had an exclusive interview with the man himself to find out what was so special about the Amber Lounge collection. Frederick, tell me, what is, uh, what is different, what's so special about this particular collection that you have? Um, I'm extremely happy with this outcome because I think some of the pieces like the one that I'm going to show you is consists of 16 different types of exotic feathers that's put together. It consists of different shades and texture of different feathers like the jungle cock and the peasants and, and um, you have also more exotic feathers that's been put together to form a very three-dimensional sleeves. This is a jacket by itself, Laro. So other things like that is a bit more, it's, it's, I should say it's like a one of a kind and then um, yeah, just watch for the drama, how it's going to be on the show, on stage. With the flamboyant couture history that has seen him push the boundaries of the unexpected, Frederick has created 15 avant-garde pieces for the limited edition Amber Lounge collection. The designs were a stunning array of swirls, colours and tie-high slashes. Check out our other clips for more on Frederick Lee's Amber Lounge collection as well as the F1 drivers in Canali.